morning y'all welcome to the vlog it is monday i mean not monday today's tuesday we just had that long memorial day weekend and i'm feeling well rested normally i go in at 11 on tuesdays but i'm going in at 7 30 today because we're supposed to be treating today like it was monday so i have to come in early normally i come in early on mondays if you're confused make sure that you watch my last weekly vlog it was i think titled work week in my life or something like that or my first week at my new office job so i'll have that linked down below in the description box and also i'll try to like put it in a little eye cards or whatever but it's seven o'clock have to be at work at 7 30 it takes me exactly 30 minutes to get to work so i hope that i make it on time just thought that i would go ahead and start the vlog off now because if i don't then i'm gonna forget i'm ready for the week y'all i'll see y'all a little bit later either when i get there or after i don't know it's a weekly vlog we never know we never know with the weekly vlog there's no structure to it you know o'clock at this point and I got off of work a couple of hours ago and right now I'm just about to go get something to eat with one of my friends so I just thought that I would update y'all real quick before I left work went pretty okay I mean not much to it it wasn't really super busy I barely had any calls today but the calls that I did have were very problematic that's a good thing because I learned a lot today so yeah, that was it. I just thought that I would come on and update y'all because I want to try to do a better job of doing that. So, I'll see y'all a little bit later. Probably tomorrow. Hey y'all, today is Tuesday and my car keeps on going off. But I'm on my lunch break. I just got some tacos. I just thought that I would come on and tell y'all about my morning because it was really hectic and really crazy. I was running late. Luckily, I made it with like two minutes to spare though. But... I was running, ooh, I think I ordered the wrong thing. No, that's not what I wanted. Dang it. You know what, I'll just talk to y'all later. I need to regroup. Today has just been really crazy for me. And it's Wednesday, it's not even Tuesday. So there's that. Good morning, y'all, it is the next day. Vlogging yesterday was just a complete fail. I'm not even gonna lie. It was, you know, Tuesday. Was that even Tuesday? No. Yesterday was Wednesday. Today is Thursday. And yesterday I was just running behind, running late. My camera battery was dead, all that stuff. So I just decided I'm just gonna pick it up tomorrow, which is today. It's 9.30 in the morning. I'm about to get ready for work. I was just drinking this little thing that I got from uh, Torchies yesterday. This Doritos grapefruit flavored soda it is so good y'all if you go to torches tacos you gotta get this and try it but i am about to do my makeup and my hair i'm trying to make sure that i leave on time today because i don't want to be stressed out like i was yesterday because today i have to take a picture for the website so i'm going to be added to the website of the company and i want to make sure that i look decent <laughs> so um i took my shower and everything um, this morning I ran to go get air in my tires because I went to go visit my grandma this morning and my like dashboard was lit up because one of my tires was just going flat, I guess. I don't know. So I did that this morning, came back home, took a shower, ate breakfast, and now I'm about to get ready for work. So 
so I'm all dressed and ready to head out now. I thought that I would share with y'all what I'm wearing, even though it's not really that awesome. Or that's just say awesome. What in the world? I I haven't said that in a long time. <laughs> even though it's not that great, I still wanted to just share with y'all the shirt at least because I chose the shirt because the shirt is the only thing that's gonna be in the photo. So I'm just wearing light wash jeans and I'm just gonna throw on some sandals to go with it because you know I don't know that's just the best I could do right now so I'm about to go ahead and head out looking for my phone got that and I wanted to kind of leave a little bit earlier because I wanted to stop and get a donut or something before I went in today so it's 10 20 right now i'm already ahead of the game because yesterday i left like at 10 30 and i was just rushing and it was a mess but honestly y'all at this point i'm really really wishing that i did my hair last night so that it can be cuter but i just didn't i don't know why and I took my work, uh, my work folder home or my work notebook home yesterday because I was supposed to fill in this little like about me thing that I that's going to go in the, can I, let me slow down, hold on. I'm just getting too far ahead of myself. I brought my work notebook home yesterday because I was supposed to fill in this little about me section and this uh, paperwork that she gave me that's gonna go on the website, but I didn't do that last night. My phone is about to go dead, but that is okay. I think I have a charger in here. I hope I do. If I don't, then I don't even think I do. Oh my goodness. What is going on? Do I run inside and go get my charger or do I just go? I'm gonna run inside and get my charger because I can't. Can't do this today. Not doing it. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, got my charger. Let's go. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if there's something in the air, but whatever it is, it's not liking me. And now it's 10:30. Need my sunglasses. sunny out here this boy y'all that's passing my house right now i think he stole my bike so i have like my childhood bike which is actually really big i can still fit the bike or i can still ride the bike i got the bike when i was like 12 or something and it was actually too big for me at the time so right now it's like the perfect size for me so i had my bike and there was another like more raggedy type of bike sitting outside underneath our carport it's been sitting there for months i've gotten on the bike and like rode it around like our driveway and stuff a couple times like in the past few months i came home the other day my bike was gone and i know for sure whoever stole my bike they've been watching and plotting because the other bike the raggedy bike it's not even raggedy it's just not as cute as mine my bike was pink and it had a basket on top of it it was so cute only that bike is gone now, if somebody really needed a bike, they truly needed a bike to get to and fro, why didn't they take the other one? So I'm thinking whoever stole it, it has to be one of these boys around here because we got new neighbors. I bet you he stole it for his sister. And when I see that girl riding that bike, you know what, I'm gonna let her have it. I don't need the bike. But still, like just the, just the fact that you would even steal somebody's bike. I probably should have put the bike inside of my garage or something, but it was fine right there where it was. I didn't think that anybody would walk up in the yard and steal the bike. I mean Hey y'all, just got off of work. It is 5.10 right now. I'm leaving a few minutes early. Normally, I leave at 5 o'clock on the dot. But we got a call last minute at 5.01 while I was packing up my stuff. And I am a good person. And I went ahead and answered the phone for them. Y'all know how sometimes 
establishments that close exactly at five o'clock sometimes you call like at 457 or even 455 but like just five minutes before close time and you get transferred over to a call service because they already closed down i am not that person i will answer the phone for you until 505 so i went ahead and scheduled an appointment for tomorrow i'm sorry it's very hot but i scheduled that appointment for tomorrow and i only had i think that was the only appointment that i scheduled uh for tomorrow all the other calls that i had today y'all were like scam calls nobody was really calling today i enjoyed my day i mostly just made facebook ads and stuff like that for the company and i'm not mad about it it was a really chill day but since i'm just in a, such a good mood why not just go ahead and go get my nails done because obviously my nails need to be done really bad you probably can't really tell because it's nude and just french chip but you see all that new growth oh my goodness it's a mess because i was gonna go this weekend but then i was like mm, I don't know because do I really want to be in the nail shop on a Saturday so this is what my nails look like don't mind my hands are still really greasy and stuff from the oil as you can see just transferred onto my steering wheel it's not completely what I asked for but it still looks decent I'm not gonna be too picky if anybody lives in the Houston area and you know any good nail techs that do really great french tip nails let me know i always run into problems with getting my nails done with the french tip nails so if anybody knows anybody let me know please my name is brie i am the host of the show as well as a self-care coach i help black women embody a lifestyle of self-care that centers rest ease abundance and liberation It's Friday, 10.15 in the morning, so I'm leaving about 45 minutes before I have to be at work, which is great because I'm hungry and I want to get those donuts by my job, and I really don't want to be rushed to eat it, so that is why I'm leaving a little bit early today. Oh, and also my co-worker got me this like little windshield cover thing, which I thought was really cute and nice. It's like holographic. It goes in my windshield so that I can like, keep the sun from... Uh, shining directly into my car so that was cute 